Well, joining us now, one of the most prominent faces in the politics of Tamil Nadu. He's been an MP on five occasions in the past. He's contesting again this time. The DMK is Mr. A. Raja. Thanks, sir, very much for being with us. Wonderful to speak to you. Uh, it's been an election campaign where the Prime Minister has personally visited Tamil Nadu eight times. The BJP has not done well in Tamil Nadu in the past. They say that this time around, they will win seats. How would you respond to that? No chance at all. No chance at all. How many times Prime Minister visited is immaterial to Tamil Nadu. Hmm. Because it is an ideological war as coined by our, Prime Minister, our Chief Minister. It is an ideological war between the DMK and BJP for which the, 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 Tamil, Nadu, the Tamil Nadu will not permit uh, saffron parties. But Mr. Eda, if, if, if we were to look at your own battle, I mean the battle that you are fighting in Ilgiris, uh, of course, you have been a five-term MP, as Vishnu pointed out. Uh, how do you look at your own battle in Nilgiris? The BJP has also fielded a candidate there. Uh, is that there, is there, it there, is there, it a triangular there, battle or is it a, a, a bipolar contest between DMK and AIA DMK? BJ, I, I think that uh, not, not I am exaggerating. Chances are that that BJP will lose deposits. Okay, so that's a that's a pretty a big statement from you, sir. Um, yes. What I think some in the BJP would be suggesting is that there is a large chunk of swing voters in Tamil Nadu. And, uh, you know, people not necessarily, people, young voters, for example, who may not necessarily have made up their minds. That, that uh, they is, may be counting on that. Is that, that an important that is, factor, Mr. Raja? No, no. That, that is artificial hype, astronomically done by the BJP, which is not true. Take it granted, most of the places, most of the places, BJP, Will not get deposits. But Mr. Raja, if I were to put this as uh, nobody gave BJP a chance in 2019 and then we saw how their look east for, uh, policy which was formulated in 2017 post the assembly victory in Uttar Pradesh actually yielded results in uh, Bengal, the BJP won 18 seats. Uh, what makes you think that uh, Tamil Nadu which has got the kind of focus or the spotlight from the Prime Minister himself will not be Bengal of 2019. No, no chance. No. You cannot compare Tamil Nadu with any other modern states. Tamil Nadu politics is separate. You can say, hey, yes, we need development. Yes, we need some schemes. That does not mean the Tamil Nadu people vote for central government, which is ideologically opposite side. Is it, a, is it a cultural issue in as much as it is ideological from, let us say, a political standpoint? The entire issue of language, the entire yeah. issue of identity... Uh, and yes, the outsider uh, versus insider yes, in this, in this election. Not, not, yeah. sir, not, 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 not for electoral politics. Almost Tamil Nadu election is over. But I, uh, but I want to put, put some things before the, the people. Yes. You must accept there is a true culture in India. There were two cultures in India. One is Sanskrit oriented culture, one is Tamil oriented culture. One is Aryan culture, one is Dravidian culture. Yes, these two cultures are having their own rich literature. Difference between Dravidian literature and Sans Sanskrit literature is caste system, Varna system is was there, which is not available in the Dravidian ideology. We want to have equality and equality in society. Mm -hmm. So that religion cannot be focused on politics. Yes, we are having our own gods. Yes, we are having our own spiritual value. We are having our own spiritual base. That does not mean it will come to politics. The other issue which the BJP has raised very, raised very strongly is the entire issue of sovereignty. And that, of course, through the prism of Kachativa, uh, where they've said that, that your ally, the Congress, has in the past not really cared about it. They brought in statements of uh, Jawaharlal Nehru. They've also said that, asked you, why have you allied with the Congress? That being the case, uh, how would you actually look at the entire Kachativa issue? All, all right, all right, all right. All senior ministers, including the prime ministers, made a statement to the effect that Kachativa was given away by the Congress government with the consent of DMK, whether it was accepted in Tamil Nadu people, whether it is issue in politics. Hmm. Whether the claim that was made by the Prime Minister and BJP as far as the Kachatev is concerned, mm -hmm. whether, it, it is, is, whether it was put in the basket for the issue in the electoral uh, uh, politics, not at all. Not at all. People will not believe, yes, Kachatev was given wrongly to the uh, uh, Sri Lanka, but not with the consent of DMK, not with the consent of Dr. Kalingan government. That is very clear. Or even on record. Okay, so you don't see this as an election very different from 2019 or 2014. But how do you make that difference, uh, Mr. Raja, that in 2019 there was that complete no-go zone for the BJP. 
there was that slogan of boycott modi go back modi right now mr modi is an acceptable face will you say that not because there all, is a lot of all, curiosity and buzz around the bjp not at all modi face will not be accepted in tamil nadu take it granted election is over i can give full guarantee that most of the places almost most of the places except one or two places most of the places bjp will, will lose the deposit Okay, do you which believe are these that, two seats? Yeah, that's my saying? my question yeah. exactly. W- what are those seats where you feel the BJP may make? No, no, no. They will not get it. They they may get the deposits. They may get the. But would you concede, they may get Mr. Raja? One or two places. Mr. One Raja, places. would you concede that no, their no, vote no, share no, will go no. up substantially? Hmm. No, no. All including party chair, party of the party, DMK is number one. Okay. The rival will be DMK. One or two places they may get deposit. BJP may get deposit. That's all. All right. Well, Mr. Raja, thanks very much uh, for and and good luck uh, to you. You've been uh, uh, a parliamentarian for so long. You face a tough contest this time around. But thank you so much for uh, speaking to us. And thank you very much. We hope much. to connect Indeed. with you on fourth of June. Fourth of June, Mr. Raja. We are already booking you for an interview. You cannot say no now. When? When? On the fourth of June. The results day. Yes, yes, definitely, definitely. All right. All right. Thank, thank you, you, sir. Thank you.